If you've received a shipment from Radwell, then you've received a bag of candy in a Radwell branded bag. How did our tradition of giving our customers candy begin? Here's the story. In the early days of Radwell, Brian Radwell wanted to put something in our shipments that let customers know we cared about them. At the start, small bags of assorted candy were packed manually by John Schwastik, who worked at Radwell. He started out packing around 200 bags a month using a hand sealer. The candy bags grew in popularity and customers reacted with positive feedback, even making suggestions about what kind of candy to add to the candy bags. According to John, everyone's favorite was bubblegum. As the company grew, Radwell's volume of orders grew. John went from 200 bags per month to 500 bags per week in a short period of time. When Radwell relocated from Morristown, New Jersey to Lumberton, New Jersey, things really exploded and John needed a bigger hand sealer just to keep up. He distinctly remembers when he hit the 1,000 bags a week mark. When John reached the point where he was bagging 5,000 candy bags per month, Brian Radwell met with him to give him some news. An automatic candy machine was being created by Radwell's engineering department. This machine was named the Schwassenator, which was John Schwastik's high school nickname. This was to honor the man who spent 10 years and many nights and weekends bagging candy for Radwell customers. The Schwassenator still operates today and approximately 2,000 bags of candy are sent out to our customers daily. For more information about Radwell, visit us on the web at radwell.com or connect with us on social media. And don't forget to look for a bag of candy in your next shipment from Radwell. Thanks for watching.